Christmas time crochet. Ah, well, hello and welcome to my channel. Today we're going to make a cute amigurumi Christmas bear. And of course, you can find the link to the written pattern with photos and further instructions and details in the description below the video. So let's get started with little berry bear. Of course, you will need some yarn, a crochet hook that matches the yarn, some safety eyes. I use quite large safety eyes here, 12 millimeters, but you can use whatever size you want. Some stuffing, some tapestry needling to uh, sew the parts together and everything, and some scissors, of course. And then um, whatever bling you want to use to bling up your little bear. Now, we're starting with the eyes. Um, with white yarn, you cr crochet eight single crochet stitches in a magic ring. Then you increase to 16 and then to 24. And then you close out round three with a slip stitch. You fasten off and leave a yarn for sewing. You make two of these bad boys, obviously. One nose to be made with black yarn. You um, start you, um, and with the nose we crochet around a chain, so it becomes an oval. You chain six in round one, and then uh, from the second loop, uh, uh, from the hook, you do four single crochet stitches and then three single in the last stitch. Then you continue on the other side of the chain and you make three single crochet stitches and one increase for a total of 12, 12, 12 <laughs> crochet stitches. Round two, you increase to 18 and then to 24 and then you decrease to 16 and then you round, uh, you finish off round four with a slip stitch um, and then you fasten off again, leaving a yarn tail for sewing. And then we start with the legs and the body working from the legs up with brown yarn. Uh, leg one is uh, six single crochet stitches in a magic circle and then you increase to nine, you crochet around at nine and then you increase to 12 and then you crochet around for a couple of rounds at 12. That's leg number one. Then you do leg number one, you fasten off leg number two. Same way, but then you don't fasten off, but you chain six and then you attach it to the first leg. Uh, and then you uh, crochet around uh, the first leg, which with round nine, you increase a little bit on the first leg and then you increase along the chain and then you increase on the second leg and then you increase along the other side of the chain with a total of 42 crochet stitches. So, um, and then you crochet around for 42, around 10, and then you... Um, increase to 48 to 54 to 60 you crochet around at 60 you increase to 66 and then you crochet around for a couple of rounds at 66 and then the decrease is starting again around 24 uh, you decrease to 60 then you crochet around for a bit at 60 you get this nice tapered shape to your little bear and then you crochet, uh, you, you decrease to 45 in round 31, and then a couple of rounds at 45, again, tapering further, then decreasing to 48, and crocheting around at 48, decreasing to 42, crocheting around at 42, decreasing to 36. Now, at this point, of course, you need to stuff as you go. Uh, at this point, it becomes interesting to sew on your eyes and nose and to attach the safety eyes because that is it's just easier to do it at this stadium than to wait until you fully have stuffed the bear and finished off the, the legs and body. At least it is to me. Um, I've sewed the eyes around uh, between rounds 39 and 45 and the nose was sewn in the middle of those uh, those eyes and then you attach the, the safety eyes uh, wherever you want the, the pupil to be. So. Then you start stuffing and you decrease further at round 47. You decrease to 30, to 24, to 18, to 12, to 6. And of course, then you fasten off and close the remaining hole. Let's make some arms with brown yarn. You crochet six single crochet stitches in a magic ring. You crochet around, you increase to nine, and then you crochet around at nine for a couple of rounds. And after finishing the crocheting bit, you fold over the, the opening of the arms and then you close them by crocheting four single crochet stitches. And uh, uh, then you can fasten off and leave a little yarn tail for sewing. Make two of these bad boys some ears. The ears are crocheted in a magic circle. First you'd make six in a magic circle, then you 
turn, so you don't crochet uh, around in, in spirals, but you turn, and then you increase in the five remaining stitches, then you chain one and you turn, and then you do the ten stitches again. So you crochet back and forth in in rows, uh, ending up with a sort of semi-circle of ten crochet stitches. Uh, of course, you can fasten off and leave a yarn tail for sewing. Very nice. And then the massive, massive little hat. <laughs> it's very adorable. You start with single crochet stitches in a magic circle. Then you increase to 8, increase to 10, crochet around at 10, increase to 12, crochet around at 12, increase to 14, crochet around at 14, increase to 16, crochet around at 16. Whew. Then you fasten off and weave in the ends. You switch to white yarn. Uh, you uh, Round 11 is to reverse single crochet stitch around. All the six uh, crochet stitches. Then you don't fasten off. You leave a... a well, you fasten <laughs> You fasten off and you uh, uh, leave a little yarn tail for sewing the little hat to the bear. And then, of course, you can uh, decorate your hat with a little pom-pom or a little jingle bell or whatever you want. Adorable. So you sew the arms and the ears to the body. And then you can embroider whatever you want, like the eyebrows or the eyelashes. Or you make little felt cheeks and a little mouth. Give him a little snuggly scarf or whatever you want. Uh, put some tinsel on it. Um, as you can see, I decorated my little bear by letting him hold a little string of tiny Christmas baubles. And I think this makes him look very festive with his little hat and everything. So you're done! Congratulations! Your adorable Amigurumi Christmas bear is all completed! I hope you had a great time making this crochet pattern. And of course, that you will enjoy your little Christmas bear this festive season. I will be back next week with another um, crochet pattern for Christmas free tutorial. And uh, you can find the link to the written patterns um, in the description below the video. And I hope you will have a wonderful time preparing for Christmas, crocheting lovely Christmas items. And I wish you happy Christmas crocheting! <laughs>